It is incredible that a time of great celebration can sometimes end in terrible tragedy. Police have launched an investigation into the shooting death of a man. All because we do not manage our strong emotions. I believe that we are an aggressive people in this region, in this region. May we allow our hearts to be changed by God's word and his unfailing love for all of us. All of us need and look forward to the moments where we can unwind and enjoy ourselves together. But sometimes in the middle of these moments, we can lose track of the need to cherish and respect the persons around us as we focus on our own pleasure. I know that with our aggressive nature as Caribbean men, many of us can find ourselves thinking and talking disrespectfully of the women that we find attractive, only focusing on their physical attributes and seeing them only as something to jam down, but failing to honor and treasure her inner beauty and strength. We can also express misdirected aggression at other men in our society, which can lead to heated arguments and great contention. The violence, domestic or gun-related, that we see around us starts because of our wrong responses to the aggressive emotions that we all have. I have chosen to let my thoughts and actions towards the persons around me be shaped by God's word, which teaches the importance of humility and treating others as better than myself. This has really changed the way that I express consideration and respect for others. And I know it can do the same for you if you submit to his will for your life. Let each of us make better use of our inner strengths as we transform our aggression into the powerful drive to uplift the society in which we live. Then we can truly celebrate together in peace and unity what it means to be made in God's image as we encourage each other to be better today.